We're all using different types of masks these days. How well masks work depends on which type you're using. In tonight's Fact or Fiction, Cairo 7's Matthew Smith explores the differences and the growing debate surrounding school reopenings. Well, not all masks are created equal, whether it's a cloth mask or surgical mask, heck, even a bandana. This animation from Florida Atlantic emulates a person sneezing using a mannequin, smoke, and lasers. So what did it find? Well, Two-layer masks kept droplets moving less than three inches. The next best? This surgical cone-style one. Droplets went eight inches. But the least effective? Bandanas. Of course, all of this matters right now as part of the CDC's guidelines to get kids back to school will rely on masks, though updated guidelines were delayed this week. So we have to get our schools open, Denmark, Sweden. We have to get our schools open and stop this political nonsense. And a new vein opened on this front during Thursday's press briefing. Headlines like this, White House press secretary, the science should not stand in the way. So fact or fiction, is that what she said? And when he says open, he means open and full, kids being able to attend each and every day at their school. Uh, the science should not stand in the way of this. So fact, she did. But it's disingenuous to pretend that's all she said. There was a lot more here. Uh, and as Dr. Scott Atlas said, I thought this was a good quote. Of course we can do it. Everyone else in the Western world, our peer nations are doing it. So really she's arguing that science is on their side. So fact or fiction, the science backs reopening schools. I'm going with undetermined. Now, I've noted here, pediatricians back opening for a variety of reasons. Heck, some countries are doing it. But what makes those comparisons difficult is that no other country is dealing with the number of cases that the U.S. is right now. And what's less known is just how much of a role children play in spreading this virus. Locally, districts were going to have until mid-August to make plans. But if in-person classes are a reality, Masks will be included. Matthew Smith, Cairo 7 News.